simply, I desire all humanity to bow before me. I will not allow that to happen if it's within my power. You see, the country in which I was born was ruined by the Empire. Or so I thought, until I learned the Kingdom had committed that heinous act. That revelation drove me to slip into the Empire. And now that I see the hypocrisy on both sides, I shall destroy the Kingdom and the Empire. But Faulkner, there's no need to involve innocent people in your revenge. You seek to destroy both the Kingdom and Empire. But don't you see? You're repeating the same mistakes you witnessed. <laughs> At some point, the weak are to be trampled by the strong. It's inevitable. Just forgive and forget. Let it go, Faulkner. <laughs> it's not a matter of forgiving and forgetting, Prince Charming. This is harsh reality. My reality. <laughs> My power over the continent shall grow to be absolute. No one shall hold sway over me again. You're wrong, Faulkner. Zolwarn will own your soul. You had a choice. Choosing to visit pain upon innocence was the wrong one. They knew nothing of your past. And besides, even if you do make them suffer, their pain won't heal the pain you feel over your lost loved ones. Can't you see that? Your quest for absolute domination won't fill the void in your soul. Enough speech, boy. Your words cannot save you from defeat in battle. I won't lose to you. <laughs> You'll have to try harder than that, boy. I cannot let you win, Faulkner. For the sake of my nation. For the sake of my friends. And for my sake, you shall be stopped. Enough babbling! Zolvorn longs for new blood! Stand and perish! I will defeat you for the honor of all those who perish to stop you! Ha! Dream on, wealth! You'll never win, Faulkner. Perhaps this will be more to your life. Take this! The time has come to end with this cheap charade. You can't seal me in darkness. I summon forth the light. Hmm? Goodbye, Faulkner. I pity you. But this is impossible. His power is breaking through. It's over. Everything is... Everything I am is over.